Well, hi dogs. You know? So, all right. that's what we're doing, man. You know? We bring it as often as we do this, it's a remembrance of him. Because he came and died for us. Nobody died for us as a nation. Give me uh, Philippians 3 and 20. My name is Sam. What's up, my buddy friend? Man, tell him God. You might recognize it. Yo, uh, uh. Philippians chapter three, verse twenty. For our conversation is in heaven, from whence also we look for the Savior, Hamasek Yahushai. For our conversation is in heaven. See, our conversation is in heaven, man. Right? From which also we look for the Savior. How about check y'all shy? We looking for him, man. Our conversation is heaven, man. Well, he told Peter what's, what's bound on earth will be bound in heaven. Huh. We follow the same tradition. That's why we start off with everything we say and do. They follow shimmer myself, y'all shy. In the name of the Lord and Savior, giving thanks to the Most High and the Father by shimmer myself, y'all shy. In the name of the Lord and Savior. Huh. Everything we say and do, the Most High is looking down upon us right now. Okay, then. Uh, or he gonna deal with us if we go off <laughs> one way or another. <laughs> He's a man of justice. <laughs> That's why we gotta be on point to the best of our ability, right, brother? Yep. That's right. Cause we got next. Uh, Who got next? We got next. Who got next? We got next. Who got next? We got next. What we gonna do? Take the kingdom. What we gonna do? Take the kingdom. What we gonna do? Take the kingdom. When? Now? How? In the name of the Lord and Savior. We got next. We want no reparations. This Bible talk about the kingdom coming to us forever and ever and ever. That's right, man. What? Man, you ain't nothing. Talk about you, God. Yeah. See, that's, that's what you get. That's what you, that, you see what it, you see? He looked just like that, pretty much. <laughs> Follow on him. All you gotta do is put them horns on him. <laughs> There, there. Put them horns on his head. <laughs> Come on, he God. Wow. Get out of here. Give me Psalms 14 and 1. He God. You hear that? Y'all heard him, right? Get out of here with that, man. They're like six foot skin and bronze, man. Yep. Like that, like that, man. Read that. Psalms chapter 14, verse 1. The fool has said in his heart, there is no power. Yeah. There's Peter, like I said. The fool has said in his heart, there is no God. See, the fool has said in his heart, there is no God. Read. There are, they are corrupt. They are, that's why he is. What is he? Corrupt. He corrupt. Read. They have done abominable works. He has done a whole lot of abominable things, man. Don't tell him what he done did. Might be a pedophile. Better keep him away from little children. Don't tell him who he is, man. Read. There is none that do it good. None of them that do good. <laughs> Come on, he got. Get out of here. Get out of here. Show me your power. Right. What power you got? Down here. Down here, right. You, you walking on the damn crutch. The damn cane. How you got? That's, that's what I'm saying. That's why we destroyed for lack of knowledge behind them. Behind them, following after them. But, I mean, they did say they got. Uh, get, get first, first, uh, Maccabees 348. They did say they got. Look like he said I'm God. They did say that. Can't deny it. What is, what, what, who do they say that is? God. <laughs> right? Look what they did. First Maccabees 348. We know we got we got the we got the goods on him. Read this. First Maccabees, chapter 3, verse 48. Right, read. And laid open the book of the law. They laid open the Bible. That's the book of the law. They laid open the white folks laid open the Bible. Read. Where the heathen had sought to paint the likeness of their images. See? These so-called white people right. did what? Paint the something. Sought to paint the likeness of their images. They sought to paint the likeness of their images. There it is right there. Here it is right here. See the boys here, man. The heathen. They call them heathen, man. <laughs> Get wisdom inside of 15 and 4. We got the goods on you, man. We know. That's why you saying you got. Damn devil, you the devil. Read that. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 15, verse 4. Right. For neither did the mischievous invention of men deceive us. So where, no matter what he said. He ain't gonna deceive us. Read. Nor an image spotted with diverse colors. An image spotted with diverse colors. Look at all them different colors. 
right? They say a pigeon word for what? Thousand, thousand words, right? Read. The painter's fruitless labor. Read the paint painter's fruitless labor. Read. The sight whereof entice fools to lust after yeah, it. Yeah, gonna follow him, man. They are fools. <laughs> don't follow that, you are fools. That's what it's saying. Read. And so, they desired the form of a dead image. So they desired the form of a dead image, man. Now, you can see that image. I mean, don't that make sense? You can look at that image, and we're reading the Bible, you can get more understanding, right? Because you can look at the image, a dead image. That dude is dead. <laughs> She's a bullshit. The second son of Pope Alexander VI in Rome, man. The devil. Read. They have no breath. They ain't got no breath, man. Read. Both they that make them, who made them? Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo painted the pictures of Caesar Borgia and the Last Supper picture, read. They that desire them, all you that desire them, or him, read. And they that worship them. They that worship them, because a lot of people got this in their house. A lot of people bowing down, they bow down, they see the so-called white man as God. Straight up. It's hard to get that out of their minds. Because that's what they've seen all their life. God. Read. Are lovers of evil things. You that you, if you if you believe in that, you lovers of what? Evil things. Evil things. Come on. And are worthy to have such things to trust upon. Yeah, you're worthy to have such things to trust upon. Read. For the potter. That's all I want, kind of. <laughs> hey, come on, man. That's why I say, you know, when you look at people of such, man, that's why we destroy it, because the curriculum that we learned was from them in school. When we go to our religious schools, we learned the curriculum of what they said we could learn all the way from slavery, because they was always overseeing us and seeing what we learning, making sure that we talking right, saying the right things, you know, to destroy the people's mind. They have something called the religious instructions to the Negroes in the United States of America. And it came out in 1620. How you gonna teach the slaves to honor and praise us as God, point blank. Until this day, you can't deny it because you know that picture is still up today. Turn on TPN, right? You see that picture right there. The Philippians 3 and 20. She vibing, eh? <laughs> When I heard what you was going to be, I thought she was riding. What you riding? No, she was riding. She was riding, buddy. Right? Yeah. What time is it? Uh, 6.45. No, 5.45. 5. Okay. Philippians, chapter 3, verse 20. For all conversation is in heaven, from whence also we look for the Savior, Hamashiach Yahushai. We're looking for a Mashiach Yahweh Shai. Come on. Who shall change our vile body that it may be fashioned like unto his glorious body? Right, come on. According to the working whereby he is able even to subdue all things unto himself. Right. And everything will be subdued unto a Mashiach Yahweh Shai when he come to judge and make war and shut down all these people. First Thessalonians, the first chapter, the 10th verse. They're going to subdue every kingdom on this earth, shut it down, and set up righteousness on this earth. And all the ones that you're going to say are going to be righteous. And all the other nations, they're going to be in captivity under us. That's what the Bible is talking about. That's why they one, one and ten. That's why they killed the prophet because it didn't happen during their time. They prophesied about our kingdom that's coming to us once we come back and judge and make war. That's what the Bible talking about. That's why they wouldn't let us read the Bible. Because if you read the Bible and came up to the understanding that we have in this Bible, it's, this is our book. They condemned some of the white man. He published it, but he didn't write it. Because most none of them challenged us in what we talk about in our doctrine that we have according to the word of the Most High, this Bible. None of them. Ah! I've been doing this almost 20 years. Ah! They never stepped for I had a TV show for 15 years. Inviting them to come to school, come to, we come together and have a debate. Never. Never. Ever. Ever. If they got the power, how come they won't challenge what we talk about coming out of this Bible? All we do is come out of the Bible. All right, brother. Why not? Because they don't have the truth. The Jews don't have the truth. The Jews, they, they ain't the Jews. We the Jews. They ain't got the, they, 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 uh, we're not the bastards. Jews. We're not the Jews. We're after, we're after the Jews. 
God ain't gave nobody no right to go over there and rob nobody. God is a robber. God is a thief. God ain't never been no thief. First Thessalonians 1 and 10. First Thessalonians. We're not African, brother. Chapter 1. I was going to name that the so-called white man, Leo Cyprius Africanus. That's a so-called white man. I mean, certain things that we've been taught, you know what I mean? Certain things, Leo Cyprius Africanus. You know, we're not from the, I'm not from the so-called white man. Read that. First Thessalonians chapter 1. Verse 10, ye are witnesses, and our power also, how holy and justly and unblameably we behaved ourselves among you that believe, as ye know, so I can, and ye know how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you as a father doeth his children. Right. That, in order, you know, in love, father doeth his children, right? That ye were walk worthy of the Most High, who had called you unto his kingdom and glory. You hear that? You gotta work walk worthy. It's not something you can just come off the top of your head. You gotta know this word, man. Straight up. That's why we, we are scholars that have learned this word, man. Inside, outside. History. You know? Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. That's not him. This is a false image. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's a false image. That's right. Uh huh. You can never deal with no false image. That's right. Oh, bless life. Because everything that you do in life. It's I, not I carnal like, to the welfare of God blessings for your life. And like me, to get that? How you gonna get that? If your heart is stony, you don't exercise authority to deal with men. Yes, it is. I'm, all I'm saying is, oh, we're, we're, this is what we are. We're the children of Israel. It's our, it's our Let me prove you. Let me prove you. You point blank. Sister, sister. Wherever sister, we sister, go, sister, Jesus sister. Christ, sister. we got images. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Listen. Let me ask you a question. You have to know what you No. Know. How did we as a people get over here to America? I know, but how we get over here? How? How they bring us? Well, you can't deal with them. You say folks, what is it? Right, they folks over here. I'm just how do we get over here? Boats? Or ships, right? Ships, right? Okay. Let's get you around I yeah, hey, 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 you know what? You know what gets me? You know what gets me? Yeah, she talks about the Holocaust, but they don't talk about the 200 mm. uh, uh, million that was uh, just go. laid out there in the, the most. There you go. They don't talk about the 200 million. That's right. But she, read Deuteronomy 1 and 1. We're going to prove that we the Israelites right now. This is very important. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1. 1 and 1. First. 1 and 1. They go to 28. Because when you go to the first books of the Bible, I can prove to you who it's talking to. And it's always talking to Israel. That's who we are, the children of Israel. Right? So we're going to Deuteronomy 1 and 1. Deuteronomy chapter 1, verse 1. Right. These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel. Moses was a black man. Okay, the whole nation of Israel was black. Black, that's right. That's right. So... The so, hey, hey, wait a minute. The land of Canaan means the allurement to the dark pigmentation of the skin. So now, so these are the words, we, These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel. Spake unto all Israel. Right? Read. On this side, Jordan. On this side of Jordan, the Jordan River. That's in Israel. We the Israelites. Not in Africa, but in Israel. Don't people black at that time. Okay? Everybody's black. Except time. for Esau, mm. even today. Ain't no that oh, time Esau, until right Esau, now. Esau, Esau the only one that got no color. Esau so called white man. Right, Esau means white and Aaron. Uh, yep. Right there. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Deuteronomy 28 and 1. <laughs> right there. That's right. That's right. Man, I love you, bro. That's you right. Here he is right there. Here he is right now, there. Now, you got to give me something. You got to give me something because you know what? I didn't like y'all at first, but you know what I like? I like y'all. I like y'all, bro. 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 I got to come back. You know, we got to get together. I'm going to see you back. There's a number there, man. Man, dog, I got you. I got you. I got you. All right. Because you know what? On the same side, what you doing? Hey, man, black folks need to know this. You're right, man. They need to know this. All praise to the most high, man. 
Uh, all praise to the God that sent you. That's right, man. you here today, and I got sent this out to you. Thank you. Oh, hey, all right. That's right. Deuteronomy 28 and 1. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1. Right. And it shall come to pass. It's going to come to pass, Ray. That thou shalt heart, shall hearken diligently unto the voice of the Most High thy power. And we listen to the Most High, Ray. To observe and to do all his commandments. He gave us commandments. Laws that your commandments, Ray. Which I command thee this day, that the Most High thy power will set thee on high above all nations. They're going to set us on high above all nations. Above all nations, if we follow his law, statutes, and commandments. Now, verse 15, we didn't, we didn't, but the church will take you to these verses from 2 to 14 and say, how blessed is you? Blessed are you? We ain't blessed. We ain't blessed. Condition that we in as a people, I'm talking about all of us. Right? Don't, don't y'all care about who it is that got something going on in this world. I'm looking at those that don't have nothing going on. That's who the most high love, be the poor. Verse 15. Deuteronomy chapter 15. Uh-huh. Uh, Verse 28, verse 15. Right. But it shall come to pass. It's going to come to pass, we. And thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Most High thy power. If we don't listen to him, he said what? To observe, to do all his commandments. This is why the condition that we're in now. We did not observe to do all the commandments of the Most High, all his laws, follow his laws, we. And his statutes. And his statutes, we. Which I command thee this day. Uh-huh. That all these curses, all shall, these what? All these curses, all these curses, we shall come upon thee and overtake thee. So from sixteen, understand this: blessings were from verse two to verse fourteen. How many is that? That's about what? Twelve, twelve verses. Now from sixteen all the way to sixty-eight are curses that befell a certain people. Now, rather than go through all these curses, I'm going to go to the last curses I asked the question. Hey, hey, hey. Go to verse 68. Uh, uh, yeah. The point that you just made is definitely certain. That's, why black, that's how that's black people are going to be. That's right. We are. And you know what? Because we all the curses. Because we have been talking to this body. And ain't nobody can miss the bad of me. You got that right. Yeah, Until this day, right? Until this and day. You know how old you are. You know about how bad it's been. Ain't nobody been treated as bad as we've been treated. So I know oh, you can't do it. That's true, right? Hey, hey, look here. I got to go down here, man. I got to get this. Wait, wait, here's one first first. Oh, here it is. I'm going to go down here. I'm going to go when I get through here. Oh, okay, all right, okay. All right. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. Well, I asked y'all how we got over here, right? But this is the curses that will befall the Israelites. Take Only the Israelites. Listen Listen what it says. And... And the Most High shall bring thee into Egypt again. So he's going to bring us into Egypt again. Okay? Into and, Egypt. And, and this because is, we went, right, right, this, this is spiritual Egypt right now. But he's going to bring us into Egypt, captivity, slavery, and bondage. So we're going to find out what Egypt means in Exodus, the 20th chapter, the second verse. Exodus chapter 20. So the first two. time we went into Egypt, read, I am the Most High thy power which have brought thee out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. So Egypt means bondage, captivity, slavery, right? So now he says it's going to bring us, you go back to Deuteronomy 28 and 1, and back then 28 and 68 again. Deuteronomy chapter 28, 28, verse 68, and the Most High shall bring thee into Egypt again. So he said he's going to bring us into Egypt again, because the first time all 12 tribes walked into Egypt. So you can walk into Egypt from right from Israel. We had to go into Egypt, and we went into captivity the last years that we were there. He said, again, how? With ships. Huh? With ships. Huh? With ships. How? With ships. So we say, we'll see us in the captivity, slavery, and bondage. How? With ships. With ships. Throw it over the side. With ships. Throw it over like the just, side. Like you just said. Yep. All kind of things. Really? You can't see. By the way whereof I spake unto thee. So the place where he was speaking to us in the wilderness, Read. Thou shalt see it no more again. And as a nation, we have not seen our homeland of Israel again. Read. And there when we go on these slave ships. When we go on these slave ships, again. read. And there ye shall be sold unto your enemy. So we say we're going to be what? Sold unto your enemy. We go on these slave ships and we're going to be sold to our who? Enemy. To our enemies. For what? For bondmen. For slave men. Go ahead. And bond women. And slave women. Now, who was so? Huh? Bring me, bro. These white folks love us. <laughs> <laughs> they, they love us. You 
unto me saying, Son of man, set thy face against Mount Seir. Mountain Seir. These are mountain people. Where they come from? What they call themselves? They, no, they call themselves Caucasian. You know what they call themselves Caucasian? Uh, definitely. Because I, they come from the Caucasus Mountains. That's between the Black wait, Sea wait, and wait, the Caspian wait, Sea wait, in wait, South Georgia, Russia. And it was sincere. The mountains. Wait, wait, and it was sincere by putting your money in slavery. Yep. And it was sincere by having their way. And it was sincere by changing God's laws around to meet their need. Yep. And they need and they need they need for sincerely to put your money in the slavery. Right. There you go. Uh, but we didn't follow the Most High's laws. That's why I said we're coming back to his laws now. That's why he, he's preparing us for the kingdom that's coming now. Because he said, hey, think about it. You still, what is the world? The world set up to send you straight to hell. Straight up. Right with them. Why I say that? Because why is it that we went into slavery that we just read? Because we didn't do what? Like you just said, obey. Follow his laws. So now if you come back to his laws, the kingdom that's, set, that's coming on this earth is set up for those that's going to come back to his laws and follow his laws. It's gonna lead to everlasting life. That's just, that's just about obedience. That's why, okay, all right, man. So, that's why he said he want obedience. He don't want sacrifice. He wants obedience. He wants us to follow him. Do what he say do. And not do opposite of what he wants us to do. Oh, you know, very important. You got any questions? You have any questions? Yeah, I do. What's up? What's up? I don't know. Uh, is, is, what, is, is, the, is um, the actual president? Is it on the country? It's kind of, they call it the Middle East uh, right now, how they, they've uh, separated. But I want to see if water separates Egypt and Israel. Mm -hmm. I don't? No. No, it's okay. Egypt. Israel is right over here. You can walk, you can walk straight across right there. It's right here. I might have a map in my Nobody have a map. You can walk from Israel into Egypt. That's why when the Mashiach Gavashai was born and Herod was trying to kill him, the angel Gabriel came and told Joseph to take take him into Egypt. Yeah. yeah. So you're not talking about going into Egypt. We ain't going just to Egypt right here. <laughs> Revelation 11 and, and uh, 8. This Egypt right here. Man. Oh. You can see it right there. It's right there. Yeah. And Africa is much bigger than the map show. Right. Very much, big. Much, much bigger. Very big. It's right. bigger than Europe. It's bigger than America. You can put a few Americas in right. Africa, man. But see, the white man made it small. That's right. Right. For his own convenience. But Europe is like it's right. huge, man. Nah, man. Nah. Nah. Huge. It's huge, man. Because my thing with Egypt and Israel is on the same land. Without the water, you put your know, water somewhere different. Yeah. It's pretty much gotta be close to the same people, right? No, we're not the same people. We have we're not the same people. Can so we have some here to give out? Thank you. Oh, God bless you. I, I Thank you so much. I don't know what they're doing. Because really, Mexico and America is on the same land. Thank you. Oh, yeah. All that's connected. And their dead bodies shall lie in the streets of the great city. Oh, you know Y'all dead bodies gonna land. He has right? Right. 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 Revelation chapter 11, verse 8. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city, which spiritually is called Sodom and Egypt, right. where also our power was crucified. Hold on. Read it again. Right. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city. See, our dead bodies are lying in the streets of the great city of America, man. Right now, man. Because I'm looking right now, man, all of us. Especially down here. Yep. The whole world watches yep. us yep. by Read. satellite. 
Which is what? Three. Which is spiritually which called. Is spiritually called what? Sodom. Sodom. And oh, wait a minute. You know why it's called Sodom? Los Angeles stands for the city of Los they, Angeles. They, they get ready. They try to, you know, Los marry men with men, women with women. Oh, yeah. All yeah. kind of yeah. wickedness. Yeah. They already did it in New York, certain, certain states, man. Those we went over that earlier. This, this uh, lady was, was having a problem about. Yeah. Uh, I guess being a lesbian or whatever, but most of us say that's a vile affection. You know, it's a vile he, he destroyed five cities. Yeah. This place is called Spiritually Edom, Spiritually uh, Sodom, Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. I mean, California, period, man. I don't, I don't know if there's any more left. Yeah, there's some more left. Man. You all right? <laughs> you all right? I thought God won't be down here now. No, he's got no angle. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Right, brother. That's right, brother. That's right. right. Tell it like it is. Right? Hey, you can go right, brother. That's right, brother. That's right. 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 You're welcome, brother. That's what we talk about, man. Huh? Which one? This right here? Oh, the horn? That's a fake one. Right. Thank you. That's right. And this, this is the dude talking about he got. Yeah. There you go. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> he got the dirty. That's, that's the problem. That we, he, did, he did say that, right? Uh -huh. we, in front of witness. He did say he's got. Did he say it? Yep. He sure said it. He might walk down the street and most of the time send an angel and drop him down. <laughs> of all, I mean, we bring him forth the power of the most high in the Bible. He going to say that? That's dangerous, boy. On. Read that again, huh? Revelation chapter 11, verse 8. And their dead bodies shall lie in the street of the great city. Yeah, our dead bodies lying in the streets of the great city of America, man. Read. Which spiritually is called Sodom. It's spiritually called Sodom because what do they do? They they got my two daddies, my two mommies teaching the children how to be homosexuals and lesbians and all that stuff. America teaches them that. Yeah, I'm supposed to say America. That's what I said, the great city of America. Yeah. Read. And Egypt. And Egypt. Captivity, slavery, and bondage. Where? Right here in America. That it? Where also our power was crucified. Our power was crucified. Now you tell me he ain't crucified. Right there with that picture. That ain't crucifixion? Over and over and over again? When they're trying to say that he's a so called white man? That man named Caesar Boys here, the second son of Pope Alexander VI of Rome, man. Rodrigo Boys here. To do that sex with his sister Lucretia. You look at the last one. That's what, look, let me show you, brother. Oh, no, that's his name. That's his name. See the boys here. Look here. That's him right there. That's him right there. Oh, we'll get it with the thought out. That, look, that's him right here. That's him right there. That's him. That's the same man right there. The same man right there. Same man right there. It's the, it's the boys here family. Who sits at the head of the table? The father. They go to man, they go his daddy right there, they go his daddy right there, they go his daddy right there. This is brother right here, his brother right there, his brother right there, his brother right there. That's his mama, that's his mama, and that's his sister Lucretia. Look at her. That's the boys here found, they have a five people in that picture. Don't tell we ain't been duped. Five people. I ain't never paid attention to I know, ain't nobody paid no attention to this picture, man. It ain't holy, let me, you wasn't here when I showed it to him. Let me show you. No, 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 no. This is the same. Look, listen, brother. Okay, listen. This is the same man right here. Look at that picture. Same man right there. Same man right there. The same man right there. The same man right there. Here goes his daddy sitting at the head of the table right here. There he go right there. There he go right there. There go his brother right here. Same picture right there, same man right there, same man right there, right? There go his mama, this is mother, that's a woman, that's a mother, that's his mama, and there go his sister, Lucretia. They called the Borgia family. Which family? Yeah, man, they had a show on uh, Showtime called the Borgia. You know what they call them? It's only five people in this, in this family, right? They call them the first crime family. First crime family on Showtime. Who people bowing down thinking that this is Christ? Right. Give me a break. Right. You want to see it too? Yes, sir. Yeah, look at it. This, is, this man named the Caesar Boys here, the same man here. And they say that's the 12 disciples. Yeah. Same man here. Same man right here. Same man right there. Same man right there. 
That's his father with his father sitting at the head of the table. See how he's got his chair sitting here? Right. That's Rodrigo Borgia, his father, Pope Alexander VI of Rome, right here, right there, and right there. Here go his brother right here, same man, same man, same man, same man. That's his, that's his mother right there, and his sister sitting beside him. All these years, and we ain't never picked that up. Look at that picture and think that this is witchcraft or something. Right. <laughs> witchcraft, something, something. Right? I mean, come on. Nobody I ever show this picture to point that out. Right. That's a model, right? That's right. And you know, we done, seen it, we done seen it a long time, right? right. Long time, man. That's right. You know? And it's unique. <laughs> okay. okay. Oh, man, I no, no, sis, right. That's him right here. Right. That's him right there. That's him right there. And that's him right there. Only over there. Okay. You don't put a beard on. That's his daddy. That's the head of the table right here. That's his daddy right there. Same man, same man right here. There goes his brother right here. That's his brother right there. His brother right there. And his brother right there. Look, this is it. That's his mother. She got lipstick on. Come on, she got lipstick. She got lipstick on. That's her mother. That's his mother, and that's his sister, Lucretia. And one of them, if you look, look at the bottom of the toe, they got the, this old now got toenail polish on. Supposed to be ten, you know, twelve men. <coughs> yeah, and they all were black, just like us. Oh, I knew that. Oh, but look, that's a lie right there, man. That's why we hear oh, this tell. This is the truth, man. Oh, yep. So let somebody else know. Right. The Borgia, they call it the Borgia, B-O-R-G-I-A. Yes. Borgia's family. Right. That's who they are, man. Borgia. Yeah, His name is gonna Caesar. Be a, it's going to be a, a rude awakening when they wake up. Yeah. yeah. See, I know how they was speaking the right. Yeah. I've been doing that. You know, right. I was raised up in the nation. Right. Right, I know. Man. We've been to uh, see pretty much. I mean, nine-tenths of the planet. Yeah. You know, to say the least. Right. Right. I have no doubt about it. All right, brother. <laughs> right, all right, brother. Man, you, I all right, brother. All right, brother. All right. All right. So I got your number, though. Okay. All right, brother. So give me uh Daniel's seventh chapter, eighteen verse. Like I said, we are the children of Israel, and you are the children of Israel. That's right. We scattered among all nations. That's right. Read that. Daniel chapter 7, verse 18. But the saints of the most...